Well, we continue our municipal election coverage tonight by looking at the candidates hoping to represent the McIntyre Ward for the next four years. Vasilio Spelos reports. While McIntyre is geographically the largest ward in Thunder Bay, it has the smallest election race, with only two people putting their names forward. That includes incumbent Albert Aiello, who is wrapping up his first term on City Council. During his time representing McIntyre, Aiello also sat on the DSAB board, Intergovernmental Affairs Committee, and was the co-chair of the Operations Committee. Aiello believes he's proven his dedication to the ward and is ready to do it again for the next four years. I worked my butt off. I've, uh, I could confidently say I've responded to every email and every phone call. Uh, I, kn I know the, the residents are, are appreciative of that. Um, whether they like the answer or they don't, the answer, the answer that I give them, they respect the fact that I did respond to them. Uh, I continue to work hard. Um, it's just in my nature. Challenging Aiello is Brent Boyko, who is new to politics but has leadership experience, including managing a large industrial facility. Along with this, the Lakehead grad has served on various nonprofit boards, including Volunteer Thunder Bay, the Atacokan Hospital Board, and the Atacokan Chamber of Commerce. Boyko's confident these experience would be relevant and beneficial for a city councillor. I'm an engineer by trade uh, with a business degree. I manage facilities uh, upwards of uh, 150 people, uh, several million dollars, uh, capital projects. Uh, so I've, I've seen it, I've done it all. I've been on the hospital boards as well, so I'm very, very much familiar with governance and the governance required from any board. Cecilio Spellos, TVT News.